everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Abdullah Khan and in today's video I'll be talking about what are the major drawbacks and what are the major problems um, with students starting at last minute preparation for the LM plus now what I mean by last minute preparation is anything of preparation onwards of May and maybe even the most extreme cases like I've experienced at the end of July to the exam day which is about to six to seven weeks and that is a very difficult time if you're starting at last minute just like me but luckily I passed the Olympus exam so I will be sharing how I did it and what are the structures and courses you need to be able to complete to be successful even at this last minute short amount of time so stay in tune for the next video don't forget to subscribe so let's get into it uh, the number one major drawback is um, vocabulary because if students who have started on time they would obviously know that they have to consistently be reading every day for at least half an hour a day as this will improve their vocabulary and they will have a wider um, wider knowledge of vocabulary than those who are starting at last minute preparation so those who are started at last minute preparation they won't have as much vocabulary as people who have started on time or even earlier so they'll have a lot of work to do in order to catch up to the amount of vocabulary that those students have so the second problem is maths because maths in the 11 plus exam is going to be uh, split into two um uh, two parts it's going to be short maths and long maths and they require you to complete short maths in a very quick time so you spend most of your time on the problem solving questions which are the long maths so in short maths many of the questions consist of times tables so if they if the students who are starting at last minute preparation if they haven't been practicing their timetables then it will be um also a very additional difficult time for them because they need to revise all their um, times tables up to 13 uh, if they don't if they just think that they can skip this learning then it will be very difficult for them because they'll be spending much more time than they need to and they'll also be making common mistakes so they'll be losing marks as well as losing time so the last um, uh, problem and drawback is uh, non-verbal reasoning and verbal reasoning because these two subjects I'm guaranteed that any student who's starting at last minute would have never encountered this in primary school because no one um, talks about these subjects in primary school we only do creative writing and other sorts of comprehension stuff but they are very easy level compared to 11 plus so that will be another um, drawback because in six to seven weeks it's a very short amount of time to be able to learning to be able to be learning and uh, mastering subjects like non-verbal reasoning and verbal reasoning because in my opinion they are the difficult the most difficult subjects because they're new rather than maths and english you already know you already have a background knowledge of them but non-verbal reasoning and verbal reasoning they're iq based questions so that is another reason why so that is the reason for this brief video because i just wanted to give you a re a reasons why um it's not so good to start 11 plus preparation so those who are in year four who have already been starting watching these videos please um i advise you to start early in time but those who have just um already started last minute those who have even started at this time right now because the 11 plus exam is still due on september 12th then please stay in tune to watch my next video on how to solve this what kind of plan do you need what kind of timetable do you need um do you need and that will be also in the description for the next video so don't forget to subscribe please comment down below on more video types you would like me to do for them plus preparation and i'll catch you in the next video